what is up guys so this is a little different video um this is going to be my statue collection normally i'm in front of the camera but today i am behind the camera because um soon me and dylan are gonna figure out you know how to edit everything and get it looking nice and crispy for you guys but until then you stinky fart jugglers we are going to be behind the camera doing one shot no edits just straight raw footage so today we are going to be going over my anime shelf and we are going to go over all the statues that i have in my collection so far and we will also go over some of the ones that are up there um first we have endeavor um i think he was probably like 60 bucks when i bought him um but super amazing detail with the flames and his whole uh hero suit and then we do have all might and this is kind of like the uh the uh uh more high-end version of him and he is uh shaded uh and everything like that which is super cool um because you know his character is made to look like a american comic book style so it's super cool that they got all that in there and then we do have one of my favorite villains in dbz uh especially the movies we have broly and he is super well detailed if you all can't tell um zenitsu here is probably about i'd like to say 10 inches um, yeah, and Broly literally towers over him. Um, but now we're getting to two of my first, uh, Grandista statues, uh, Ultra Instinct Goku, which my dad bought me for my birthday one time, and he was only, like, 24 bucks, and then Kakashi, which was, again, only, like, 30 bucks, and you get all that detail in the character. Next, we have Aaron Yeager. I forgot what brand this was but super cool um you know all the detail and everything is super awesome and i i just really like this figure one because i like aaron and two because i love attack on titan next we have frieza golden frieza and he is i think it's like a king the the one that does endeavor broly and all might and frieza are called like king king uh king collectibles or some something like that some shit like that but super cool obviously the golden metallic look is amazing and the purple metallic you just can't get any better than that then we got zenitsu the grandista i will be getting zenitsu uh his other two pals uh tanjiro and uh Inosuke, I'm just kind of waiting to get them. And down here we move kind of to our smaller um, figures, more in dynamic poses. In the back you can see we have our energy drinks, we have the Soul Reaper, the Power Boost, the Plus Ultra, and the Ignite Bakugo. And we do have uh, Naruto back there, we have Dragon Ball Super Broly. Um, super cool statue, by the way, on the bottom, uh, you can't really tell, because it's kind of ghosty, um, but he does have, uh, engravings on the bottom of his base stand, and one of, one that I was super excited about was this Ichigo that, uh, Baron Presto made, um, super badass, and I'm so happy that we are finally getting Bleach, like, statues other than the older ones. And here you can see I have all my manga, my remotes to my lights, and we do have some Huginis, just like we did over here, but those are sealed, these are not. Um, but we do have a bunch of manga that I just enjoy, whether it's I liked what happened in the story at that point, or I love the cover art and everything, but super, super cool um, to be able to fit the, the manga back there with all the statues. In the back, we see we have Deku. Um, I think he was like a texture series. We have 
Rengoku, which is one of my favorite statues and one of my favorite characters in anime in general. Um, so super cool to have him. And we do have Meliodas, the goat, um, right here. And I forgot what his, his, uh, his, uh, brand was, but super cool. And I really like his figure. Um, down here, we have Trunks, Ben Presto. We have Captain Levi, which is a super cool one. And then we have Mega Me. Uh, super cool. Um, it would be badass if they did the actual demon dogs with him. They, we have Super Saiyan 4, Vegeta, Tanjiro um, with Deep Box. And that Vegeta is actually from Dokkan Battle. Then we have Super Saiyan 4 Goku doing the Kamehameha. Um, super cool. That's actually one of my favorite characters in uh, Dragon Ball GT. Obviously, I mean, he's the main character, but Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta has to be my favorite uh, character. Other than Baby, but Baby Vegeta. But in the back, you can see we have Todoroki. Super cool. I need to get a Bakugo statue soon. And, um, we do have, uh, Bardock right here, Goku's dad. And that is him in Super Saiyan form. So, super cool. Um, this is the, the shelf with mainly all my statues. And then if we come up here, um, to where the pops are at, we have the, uh, these are kind of like fight scenes. So, this is when Goku fought Frieza on Namek, which is super cool. Um really enjoy both of those i kind of have them separated across the pop shelf and then we do have goku black in his rose form and goku um going uh super saiyan blue kaioken and that is super cool to have both of them i believe theirs was the blood of the saiyans or something like that um and then this one i forgot what this one was called um but super cool and I really enjoy um, all these figures. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. That's all the uh, the uh, statues I have. And uh, I hope y'all enjoy seeing something other than just Pops. And I hope y'all just, you know, uh, uh, you know, y'all find interest in in uh, something a little bit more uh, character accurate other than Pops. But uh, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it, and I appreciate you guys for watching. I'll catch y'all guys in the next one. Peace.